Well, I mean, it is so disturbing for those of us who understand the plight of the Cuban people. I mean, my family was one of thousands who were impacted by the Fidel Castro regime. I mean, Fidel Castro took away the freedoms of the Cuban people. I mean, my father, who built his life there he, and, and was successful, uh, everything was taken away from him. And when he stood up against Fidel Castro, was thrown into jail and tortured. Uh, many of his friends were killed. Uh, and those are just, my father's story is just one of many. And I will tell you, it's learning about this history and understanding the evils of communism, the evils of socialism, the government takeover of these countries that leads to the destruction of these countries where the, at the end of the day, the people suffer. And for Bernie Sanders and for Biden to support these policies that basically praise the dictator and the regime. Now, because we have to remember, it was President Obama who went over to Cuba, uh, sat with Fidel Castro at the baseball, uh, with Raul Castro at the baseball game, and mm. talked about praising not only the education system, but the health care right. system. It's all the same for these Democrats when it comes to Cuba. 